just going to get straight to it. I hope you guys will appreciate what I have to say. I've always been straightforward on my channel. Like it, don't like it. That's the beauty of YouTube. What I saw today on Lyft was sickening. I went out and did a little lift today. I went out and drove for about two and a half hours <clears throat> just to keep my lift account in, in, in good standing in case something should happen and what I saw was sick I want you guys to take a look at the screenshot I'm going to show you right now two dollars eighty four cents two dollars eighty four cents are you kidding me so just a few years ago, you the driver was making 80% of the fare, and Lyft and Uber were taking 20. Then, unfortunately, in California, where I unfortunately live still, 22 came around and screwed everything up. And it made a whirlwind across the country. And Lyft and Uber started doing whatever the hell they wanted to do. Now they take as much as 70 to 80% of your fare. They're overcharging the customers. They're underpaying drivers. And now, what used to be a minimum trip, it didn't matter if it was 100 feet or a mile. But it was $3. Now, it's $2.84. Yet, they are still charging the passenger a minimum of eight dollars and ninety six cents. Eight dollars and ninety six cents to go less than a mile or up to two miles and they're paying the drivers two dollars and eighty four cents. Now in California, I'm sure it's been everywhere. I just got back from Vegas. Gas prices in Vegas were five dollars and four cents gas prices in my market just went over six dollars and nine cents and down in la they're over seven dollars it's over seven dollars a gallon fortunately i have the upside app and i actually make about 40 bucks a month cash back and if you're familiar with the upside app great if you're not download it go to your app apple's app store whatever your uh, Android App Store, Play Store, whatever the hell you want to call it, download Upside. And my promo code is NZE74. NZE74. Feel free to use it. I don't care if you use it or not. Use your best friends if they have Upside. You have got to do something. I've always tried to be legit on this channel. I've always tried to just say it the way I see it and like it, don't like it, you know, whatever. I've always tried to do my best to give the best information I could. But for $2.84 for a minimum fare, I'm sorry, I'm going to call bullshit. Because if you're down in L.A., Beverly Hills, Sacramento, whatever, it may even be lower. I don't know what what the prices are up in, up in the more rural areas of, of Central and Northern California. But you've got traffic, traffic, traffic. You, you may be three miles from a minimum pickup and it's saying you're going to get three dollars lyft is showing that your minimum the minimum you know charge for that ride or what you're going to get paid is three dollars but if you don't go three miles you're getting two dollars and 84 cents but you still have to sit in traffic for 10 minutes are you is it worth it no because by the time you're done you've probably burned that much money in fuel. So you haven't made anything. I could not believe what I saw on that screenshot. <laughs> and then to top it off, and this is where it's going to get sore for some people. Some Desperado drivers are still stupid enough 
to take these trips and then bitch about it and say, I'm not getting paid enough and not do anything. Well, you know what? What I saw today makes me really glad that I'm back in the medical field doing what I'm supposed to be doing because this was never supposed to be a job. It's never going to be a job. It's work. It's a side hustle. And it's a lazy man's way of making money. You know what I mean? And at $2.84 a trip, you got to be an idiot to work in, in a heavy, heavily populated area and take these junk rides. Don't do it. Go to, check out the rideshare professor. Check out Dustin is Driving. Rideshare Drivers United, RSDU, anything. You guys want to make more money, you got to get off your ass and stand up because it's only going to get worse. I can't believe the gas prices are between six and seven dollars a gallon this week. And this week is when I first started noticing that Lyft has dropped their minimum trip from three dollars to two eighty four. Well, like the video, don't like the video, it's the truth. Use upside, save a little bit of money. Don't use it, it's your money. I'm just trying to let you know how, you know, it's just my opinion on it, and it sickens me. So if you're going to continue to drive and not say anything to help get these rideshare companies to do something different, drive. But don't bitch about don't bitch about not being able to pay your bills because Lyft and Uber don't pay me don't pay you enough. It's your choice. I choose to work a real job, make real money, and not ever have to be dependent on these crap ass rideshare companies. Until next time, I wish you all the best of health. Do the right thing.